Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Let's keep going on with this crazy idea of DIYing my entire wedding. Today we're talking about the reception desk. Before jumping into the reception desk ideas, I would like to make a couple of considerations so we are on the same page. After the mystery of wedding, normally the couple is going out to take some pictures and this is the most boring time for guests you can't deny it. My thoughts to make it more bearable for the guest were, first of all, the couple have to take maximum one hour for the pictures, and second of all, make an interactive reception desk. The first step is to organize an aperitivo. I was extra lucky because my family and I, we produce wine, a small quantity of wine, so I was using my own wine and I make my own label. I have a video about it, if you don't remember, check the card here up. The second step is realize the perfect photo booth at the reception. This will help keeping the guests busy while they're waiting for the couple and it has an extra use, double use. You can use it for extra wedding pictures and you can use it as a backdrop. You already know by now, to get inspired, I went to Pinterest and I decided to go for an arch draped in one side so that I could leave the other side more rustic. I'm trying to do the arch that pieces are too small. I have to put more than one together. It's starting to become an arch. Look. Like I should fit. You know that normally they do one here and one here and here at the top, they do this piece. But it's a little bit like uh, I'm gonna be hanged during my wedding. So I was thinking if I use the L shape that you use like in shelves and at the top kind of nice ones, maybe it can work. I found some L-shaped hello boys and I'm gonna spray paint in black and the color is ready I am ready for action <laughs> Argo are you ready for action as well yes this is the look of the arch I think I'm gonna put the Tilema who says like these. Maybe I like them like this. Then we decide to put it in this way. I'm gonna show you the result. How do you see me? This is the arch of the love. The idea is to put some flowers in this part. Hello Argo! And on the other part there will be a drape. Maybe we're gonna drill here a hole and we're gonna insert the flowers hmm. okay this is definitely the final of the arch nice Argo Argo oh my god have you seen him in the invitation exactly the same thing The third step for my reception desk has been playing with plants. I really think that plants are so important for all your wedding. They can really bring an organic and healthy touch. And after I found out a cage in my parents' house with the help of this Pinterest inspiration, I decided to go for a plant in a cage. I found this 
gem of a cage at home. I'm gonna sand it and then I'm gonna... I'm gonna cover it in gold maybe or in black? I don't know, let's see. Okay, I couldn't do more sanding and now I'm gonna put the metal primer. It's upside down and I made the cage black. We have cellophane in the cage as well. I'm gonna put this soil inside. I'm trying to frame with a palette. This is how the cage look by far. Of course, I gave it time to grow, so for the wedding, it has the perfect dimension. The fourth step to make your reception desk more interactive is having a guest book and if you make it it will be even better i wanted to show you the guest book that arrived yesterday here we go it's a kind of fake wood it's written guest book and there are some olive leaves that is perfectly our style and i'm planning to patch some pictures of ours with some lines so that people can right okay i can show you what i did because it is in three languages share some love some wishes here are you canon or nikon because we started with one nikon and one canon but then my boyfriend became canon is it the first time in greece for you are you team groom are you team bride write an adjective an adjective for the um, groom and for the for the bride and here I had something really funny and I mixed our numbers Tilara and Saremakos where are you from write something uh, strange about some uh, some fun facts about the um, the groom and here we got about the bride then here I like to know the nicknames for the other spouse in your language so people can just sign here and here we have thank you in all the language of all the people that I invited and then sorry for the long post here's a potato please comment if you get it The fifth step for my reception desk has been DIY bracelet for women and a composition of flower and olive leaves that you put in the pochette for the men. I wanna do decor with olives because I have plenty of olives. But the thing is that I don't know how much they stay like so green and uh, and flexible this is exactly one week right now and it's pretty good so i can prepare everything one week before i got this kind of uh, um, ribbon you just do a double uh, knob i will take a couple of leaves one fake rose i'm planning to have kind of this result with a hot glue something like this and then for men something like this this is how i hope my bracelet will stay moisturized The last touch of my reception desk has been the tableau de mariage and I have an entire video that is showing how to DIY this as well. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, as always, please give it a thumbs up and it's really, really important that you subscribe. It's the red button down there. See you in the next one. Bye!